Howdy guys, it's Tachi and welcome to some Neverwinter footage. Now, uh, I haven't played Neverwinter since the game released, but I heard there were some changes. And also there's this new hero, or, or I guess they're heroes, this uh, hunter that I'm playing. And uh, if you want to play, click the link below, make an account. Even if you're not going to play, click the link below, make an account. And it'll really help me out. I'll, I'll make some money. Uh, I can't not allowed to tell how much but it would really really help me out it's quite more than what you would think it would be so doing that let's get started let's talk to the guard gate I skipped the uh you're the one sergeant Knox had to investigate well I'm glad you're here we've heard some strange noises from the vault one of the other guards went to check on it but he should have been back by now I have to guard the entrance but I'll let you through find the source of okay. those noises and look for Quartermaster Otis. He'll know what's happening. So I skipped the intro crap and decided just to uh, do this little bit and see how it records and everything. It looks pretty good though. So this is the new uh, hunter, which is kind of cool. Let's open this door. I have a level 40 uh, cleric. Ooh. Ah, look at that. Just spam the multi arrow. Wow, so uh, the right click that I have is the is the uh, multi-shot like I just showed you. And then my left click is just a single, tar single target. And I also have this cool ability. That's Q. Then I have daily powers. Or monthly powers or whatever they're called. Up there at the top. Now, I, I liked the game back when it started, but it was just a, a little too buggy being a healer and all. Let's, oh, I'm not a thief, so I can't get that skill kit. We'll have to see what's going on in here. There's my. There was my uh, other shot. I think I have a little coinage here. Looks like it was a sneak attack. But I got it. I do like the... Uh, the people uh, having voice acting for their quests is kind of nice. Not having to read all the time. Ooh, there's a chest here. Ooh, a dungeoneering kit and a nature kit. So these kits allow us to uh, to do these that we normally wouldn't be able to. So it's like I said, it's been a long time. If you followed my channel at all, you noticed that I had some before. There we go. So we can just and I used my uh, my uh, daily power there. They're called daily powers, but you get them quite a bit as you can. Let me hit Alt and show you. So here's my daily power. Fire a concussion blast. The ground causes a shockwave that pulls enemies in and damages them. So I don't know if I like the Hunter that much. I'm used to my Cleric. And after so long of playing, I forgot how to play him. So I thought I would play this for a while, then maybe go back up to my Cleric, do some dungeons, maybe some PvP. And boy, with any free-to-play game, there's sure a lot of spam. Ooh, I got an amulet. What is this? A small shrine? Yeah, that's right. Let's equip that. And that puts a shrine on the ground right here that heals us. Huh. Man, it's been so long. There's some armor. You can see I have some Zen. I have some astral diamonds and stuff on my other character, but it's been a while. So let's take care of these guys. And here's my character. Here's my history that you get to make when you're at the beginning. I like I started at the moonshot. The Moonshi Isles is uh, where my origin story is. So here's my powers. And like I said, at the very beginning you don't get much to choose from, but later on you get quite a bit. There's my feats, my boons. 
here's my companion slots and I don't have any yet I don't think you get them until 20 something Wow this guy's really powerful for for grinding get out of there it's kind of cool that they can't see you when uh they can't see you when uh, you do that let's get out of there double tap to evade I loved my cleric but man it was so broken when the game first came out you couldn't heal without pulling aggro the Nashers snuck into the vaults during Valindra's attack on the city. They're here to steal the crown of Neverwinter! They almost got to it, but then they angered the dead resting in the lower vaults. They're fighting each other down there right now. I sealed them in behind the hidden entrance to the lower vaults. There's a secret switch in the bookcase on the back wall. Stop the Nashers before they get the crown! Cool. So you gotta love the voice acting. So there should be some stuff over here to explore. Oh, that's a religion skill, which I can't do. There's no kind of a uh, no kind of sprint except for that. That's another one I can't get. Well, let's just follow the line. Where only after the crown touched nothing else, we can loot the rest once we rule the city. Oh, that's awesome. How awesome in life would it be in real life to have a bookshelf like that? You must die. What? Then we have the rotters. Man, that is... That is a little bit strong. Supposedly there's coming out with an Icewind Dale patch that I might take a look at later on. Yeah, just keep picking stuff up. Look at the AoE. This is really strong. Well, this is the beginning of the game anyway, so... Like, it matters that much. Just showing you a basic, uh... Basic rundown of the class. Here's another Dungeoneering. Oh, the kit broke. I don't have another kit, so... Let's take these guys out. As you can see, my daily power... Let's get away from him. We just hold it in the left plate, get rid of that. Ah. Okay. You gained a scroll of identification. Yeah, so uh items have to be identified. Right an unidentified object and select identify to use the scroll and reveal the item stats. I don't have anything to do that, but sure. I might start playing this game a little bit more. I'm kinda of in a crunch now since WoW's not going to be released until uh, December. So there's really nothing for me to play, so I decided just, hey, why not try out a game that a few people play? Might get to do some uh, raiding. Alright, and we're back. Sorry about that. Forgot I was still in, uh, still in team speed. Huh, what is this? Ooh, uh, another bow. No, 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 get out of here. Oh, that is awesome. Let's get out of here. So you have to have agility or that green bar at the top of the yellow bit. Here, let me point right here. Right here, you have to have uh, stamina in order to do those sprints away from enemies. So you can't just spam it. Which I think is pretty cool. Ooh, an arcane crystal. Not bad. Might be able to get something from it. There's something over here. Oh, that's the nature kit. 
Let's keep following the, uh, keep following down here. Yeah. So these paths make it pretty easy. For quest. Of course you can, you can turn it off if you want with Z. And we have us another regen area. And get my health back. I really like the UI of this game. It's uh, simple, yet informative. You don't have to have a whole complete screen full of stuff just to play. Oh no! Hurry and get the crown! The Guardian is waking up! Huh. Graphics look pretty good in here. Guardian of the Nine. <laughs> You look nasty, sir. Wow. Let's try to get back and kite him some. Let's get him. As you can see, my stamina's on. Let's try to kite him a little bit more until our... Until our energy, our Q's back up. Back. Right click a little bit. We have a potion that we could use, but right now I don't need it. And he should be dead. Yeah, we killed him. <laughs> You're too late! The crown belongs to the Nashers! The Nashers? What kind of name is that? And I didn't equip my new bow. That could help. And what is this? This is all Tinker Road. So all the items have uh, cool looking graphics, which is pretty cool. You get some pretty cool looking armor as well. I'll have to show you my cleric sometime. Here's a scavenger belt. We always use a belt. And let's head out of here. Looks like we didn't make it in time. And head up the stairs, up the stairs. Too bad there's not a run. I'm used to being there's some kind of sprint button, these kind of games. So here's our uh, major city, which you'll get to see uh, lots of people. So there are people actually playing the game. As you can tell, my frame rate jumped, or actually dropped from 60 to 30, but that's just because I'm recording. And the game looks amazing. I have uh, everything on Ultra pretty much, because it runs better on Ultra for some reason. So let's talk to this guy. Protectors Enclave need your Nash's will pull to raid the vault so soon after Valindra's attack. Thanks for your help in defending the vault. Unfortunately, the Nashers have got away with the crown of Neverwinter. The crown is a powerful symbol of rightful rule in this city. It must be found, for the Nashers can use it to start a rebellion. So there, just hit level 5. So if you'd like to see more videos uh, of Neverwinter, maybe some PvP or some higher level dungeons, be sure to let me know. And like I said, click, click the link below, make an account, and it'll help me out quite a bit. This has been Tachi signing out. Have a good day.